back this is a belgian double an abbey beer from aflehem which i'm assured is how you pronounce it afle afle gem or afle game it reads as aflehem anyway so it's a belgian double from Aflahem, not Bethlehem, Aflahem. Let's have a wee look on on top. I have I poured it earlier, and I tried drinking it. It was way too cold. It's two Celsius from the sub, so I've let it, I've let it sit for I don't know twenty five minutes, half an hour, something like that. And it has warmed up slightly. It's still it's still very cold. It's cold in here. Well, it's, the room temperature is 17 Celsius. So that's that's not very warm, really. So it's still very cold to the touch. So when I first tried it, I was getting, I was getting nothing. There was no aromas. There was, wasn't much flavour. And yeah, I've had this before. Well, with the same uh, top. Let it warm up, and it's a different beer when it's a bit warmer. Anyway. Yeah, so it's from Flanders in Belgium. It's a Belgian double, 6.8%, 21 IBU. So it's a rich ruby brown with a firm silky head. Head's gone. And strong natural carbonation. Nope. This is the same beer. It's absolutely beautiful. The colours, there's a lot of uh, condescension on the glass. I'll just wipe away this compensation. The colour is so beautiful, nutty brown. It says, the, the, I'm getting a bit of maltiness, that's it. It says, leads in a complex clove spice, anise, raisin, molasses, and banana aromas. No. I'm getting none of that. Not even the, the treacle, the molasses. Just nothing. I hope I've not got COVID. A deep spice, spicy clove flavour mellows into softer caramel fruity taste. Cheers, my dears. It's very cold, very cold. But that banana comes through, the caramel fruitiness. But that's it's even really cold to the touch. That's the thing. One of the biggest drawback with the sub is two Celsius. That is way too cold for most beers I don't know why they, I don't know why they, they set it at that what I'm going to do the next time I, I review a beer is I'll I'll put it in to the machine at the correct temperature, drinking temperature and rather than let it chill I'll, or the, I'll, the machine will just pressurise it rather than keeping it cold so, I think that's what I'll do next, because this, I'm not saying it's a write-off, this review's probably a write-off, 
because I'm getting absolutely none of the the subtleties of the beer. I mean, I, I have poured another drink there. Because that's a larger volume glass, it retains the, the cold. <laughs> so that's even colder than that. This is the Affled Hem glass. And because it's, it's quite fluted, but that is very cold to the touch. So I'm thinking that's even colder than 2 Celsius. So, get a swirl on it. I'm getting the cloves and the, the spiciness, the banana, from this, because I've got a good, I've got a good swirl on it. You know, there's quite a bitter edge to that as well. Oh, what? Just a bit. What is it? What is the IBUs on this? It's twenty-one. So it's Aflahem Dubel Double from Aflahem Brewery in Flanders. It's a Belgian double, six point eight percent ABV, twenty-one IBU. One friend's check-in. 4.25, everybody else has 105,000, we're on average 3.46, ah, I think that's criminal. It says it's a ruby, rich ruby brown, the colour is gorgeous, with a firm silky head and a strong natural carbonation. Leads on complex clove, spice, anise, raisin, molasses and banana aromas. A deep spicy clove flavour mellows into softer caramel fruity taste. A silky spicy mouthfeel, finely balanced alcohol with plenty of hoppy dryness, gives great structure and keeps it brighter than many other doubles. On swirling, the yeast bite gives out stronger banana notes, yeasty spice, and aroma hops. I think that's been tr translated. The descriptors are dark, sweet, smooth, strong, malty. Yeah. This is beautiful. But I, f I feel as if I'm not getting the full benefit out of it. Anyway, I don't know if I'll post this review or not. It's a bit of a disaster. I might, I might. Disaster upon disaster. <laughs> These things are said to try us. They are mere bagatelles. Don't let things like that bother you. I might do another review of this when it's warmer. Maybe put the heating on in my... I've not got the heating on. I, I didn't feel the need for it. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. If you can find this, try it. It's absolutely beautiful. My rating, my score, 9.5 out of 10. Cheers, my dears. Smooth, silky, gorgeous.